guys in the previous video i showed you how to upgrade the firmware of uh, this uh, linksys uh, u1000 router uh, using ddwrt uh, firmware so i connected this router to my computer you can see the ethernet cable is here i can you can see the lights are blinking so it is in port one and uh, now I'm, I'm coming back to my computer so just wait a moment So at first I need to log in to the router's um, default IP address, I mean the settings, it is uh, 192.168.1.1 and press enter. In the previous video I told you that uh, after upgrading the firmware to DDWRT uh, I have uh, I, I did a reset of the router that means a hard reset using that red button so now it is giving me the option to change the username and password so i'm going to give all the name and password as admin 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 so password is changed now guys you can see the router is still not uh, get any um, uh, one ip so at first you need to go to set up status and from here you go to wireless now you do a site survey to find uh, to identify your main router so uh, my main router is this one here so i'm going to join here with the main router and press continue so you can see after this is it gave me the this option automatically and this will be wireless uh, 2.4 gigahertz and this is the name of my main router so here you need to make some changes in the settings if you need like here sometimes it can be other settings so uh, ap I i'll uh, give it as, as client and um, wireless mode is mixed and the name as it is so let me just save the settings once you are done with that you need to go here to enter the password for your main router this is the main router um, wireless uh, you know name so here i'll write this one uh, the setup should be exactly as it is in your previous the main router so in my main router the setup is like that and i'll enter the password so just set the settings and <clears throat> Anyway, you are done up to this much. So now go to administrator, administration, and do a reboot of the router. It will take a couple of minutes, maybe two minutes maximum. Guys, you can see the reboot is completed. Uh, but I do not know why it did not still receive the uh, one IP. So let me check it. Oh, I do not know. I think I forgot to save the settings. So I need to do it again guys i'm so sorry let me see it is caps lock or no, it's not caps lock so i will save the settings and press apply settings i forgot to apply last time that's why i did not uh, done it so Check the basic settings, everything is looking good. So let me do a restart again. Sorry, 
from the administrator. Uh, oh, guys, you can see already it has received the one IP. So that means it is now connected to the internet. Oh, here you can see it is showing internet access. So that means um, only because uh, it has not applied the settings from this uh, part here, the wireless security settings was not applied before. So anyway, uh, this is uh, one way and if you want to use it as a repeater, just go here, change it to repeater and save it you'll get here another virtual interface uh, remember uh, if you s set up it uh, as a repeater then you can give another name for your wireless router so exactly i'm going to do that here now so <clears throat> let me give a name of uh, yeah ddwt1 you need to save it and apply the settings so let me check if the internet is available yeah the internet is working now you see the coronavirus update guys lot of people are suffering from this coronavirus so be careful uh, stay safe and stay protected uh, please like and share my video and subscribe to my channel guys thanks a lot for watching this video and taking your time